Rarely do I ever drop my jaw in shock whenever certain movie news comes out. But the Sonic of the Hedgehog franchise, and more specifically, the shadow casting, is news that I have been desperate to find out for a while. And when this news dropped, my jaw dropped, and I went insane style. And now I just want to talk about this because this is definitely one of the best castings ever. So let me explain why. Because first of all, obviously, Keanu Reeves, who's now Shadow of the Hedgehog, has the perfect intimidation voice. He sounds like Shadow by default. And I know so many people wanted Hayden Christensen to be casted, but after the news was released that Keanu would play Shadow, I went out to YouTube to hear what Hayden sounded like again. Like a, an under component to the, to the suit, um, where if you get too hot, they plug you into this machine and it, it pumps uh, cooling liquid all around your body to sort of cool you down. And honestly, I feel like Keanu makes more sense if you wanted someone to naturally play a shadow. And if you think about it, I feel like the people that wanted Hayden was just the vocal minority. And more people deep down inside wanted Keanu to play him, but they didn't think Paramount could get him because he's so big time. But I guess we were wrong, and that's kind of why I want to applaud Paramount and the Sonic team for. And that's when it comes to the Sonic franchise, they are hell-bent on listening to fans. Because if you go on MyCast, which is a fairly known fan casting website, Keanu is the number one choice amongst fans to play Shadow. So I'm assuming Paramount saw this demand for Keanu to play Shadow and actively tried to pursue him with the biggest fat stack of golden doubloons possible. And if Paramount did hire Reeves because of the fans, then they need a big fat clap of our meaty smackers because this is goaded. And I think this is the third time that they actually listened to the fans. Because in the first movie, they listened to the fans about redesigning Sonic. And in Sonic 2, they released a poster with four names but left Tika Sumter, who plays Maddie, and Colleen Oshognesi, who plays Tails. And this caused a lot of outcry from fans. So Paramount listened to them and replaced the original poster with a new poster of the entire cast. And now presumably they casted Keanu because we wanted him. So once again, good on Paramount and the Sonic team for being one of the few franchises to respect and listen to fans. But moving on, let's talk about Keanu Reeves because he has been going on a blockbuster tear for years right now and has come out with so many movies and almost all of them have been big. Like from 2019 onwards, this is his resume. You have John Wick 3, Always Be My Maybe, Toy Story 4, The Spongebob Movie, Bill and Ted, Cyberpunk 2077, The Matrix Resurrections, DC's League of Super Pets, John John Wick 4, and what's yet to be released is Constantine 2, Ballerina, Berserker, and now Sonic 3 goes on that list. Like, this guy is bulldozing Hollywood with these big roles, and he wholeheartedly deserves them. And like, the only other person who comes to mind when it comes to consistently being in big movies is Tom Cruise, who I think is amazing company to be in. But yeah, I just love this franchise to bits, and it brings out the inner child Sonic fanboy inside of me every time I watch clips of it with my little siblings on YouTube. And you best believe I will watch this movie on day one and buy whatever possible popcorn bucket they sell. But yeah, that's it.